All right, guys, so today I'm here. I got the Kyosha Mini Roll Drive. Um, sorry about my voice. I've been a little bit sick lately. As you can see, this model is the Audi. Very nice presence there in the box. So as you guys can see, here's what I paid with uh, without taxes, one seventy four ninety nine out the door. Not bad. Support local if you guys can. Actually, um, tape here. So they didn't cut all this off. It's also very nice that they come with, uh, they're just zip tied in, you don't need like an hour or anything to free them from the from, uh, stuff here. So there's that one, and then this one, very easy to get them done, very nice, I like the way Kyosha did that. Um, and that should just pull right up from the thing here, there we go. And as you can see, it's held in through the battery tray. So then you'll have to go ahead and undo this. Cut the body so you can get the body out freely. Okay, that's weird. Um, so then you just go ahead and get the body out. Feels pull like that. And then down. And then like that. And then it comes free. Um, to get these zip ties off, I'll have to take off these. Which is easy peasy. So I'm just gonna cut it. I'm just gonna pull it down through. Same with this side. The same thing over here. And I'm gonna take off the battery tray then. So there you go. And then put the body back on. You just smell it. I'm kind of disappointed this one didn't come with lights. That sucks. My dad's came with lights, why am I? Go ahead and snap that all back together like that. So there we go. There's the car. Oh, a little manual here. Kind of nice to give you a full manual. Comes this box. This is gonna have all your extras in it. Uh, you get some extra plastic pieces with some pin gears, if I'm not mistaken, and then you get your cones and your uh, your cones and your tools. What I'm gonna do quickly is I'm just gonna open this up. That I'm gonna pull some of these cones out of here because we're gonna use some. Okay, so the first thing you have to do when you get your Mini Z is you're going to have to throw batteries into the radio and the receiver or into the truck or car. I suggest you use uh, these. I use these for the cars just because they're easy to use. And then for my remotes, I just use the energizers. 
or any really AAA battery for the radio. If you want to use rechargeables on the radio, you can, but I suppose it depends on how many rechargeables you get. It's got batteries in it, so some batteries in the car. And to be honest, guys, this is one of my biggest flaws, or one of my biggest hates about the Minisies. Um, if you're asking my opinion, I think it's really stupid. <coughs> That's kind of what's opted to keep uh, triple A them instead of creating a battery or making a battery for them. Um, And I just, I think it's, I just personally, I think it's really stupid. That's just my opinion on things. So there we go, we got batteries in the car. And then you gotta turn your switch on down here in between the chassis. Going through and double checking my batteries, guys, because for some reason the car is not turning on. So it looks like they're in there correctly. Go and snap a little bit together. Give it a second, maybe the link here. Hey guys, I'm gonna figure this out. I'll be right back. Alright, so here we go, guys. We got it working. I'm not sure exactly what happened, um, but yeah, it wasn't the batteries. See, it's kind of become more challenging than anything, honestly, uh, on this carpet that's in here. Uh, fluffy carpet, they don't like it. It might all work fine. Depends how much room you got on the right here. This is kind of, this is kind of get a little bit of a, of a feeling for it. Oh, the tires just kind of look really slickish, um, so don't really like to get good grips that make sense on this.
there you go guys there was a drive of the little Audi R8 I mean as you, as you can see there's just a couple things I want to mention here for you guys um, if you're looking at getting one of these just keep in mind that the gearbox is fully open um, so like a basement floor that's full of dock here isn't going to be the best just things to think about and these also have about no ground clearance this is just a zip tie barely fitting underneath um, here's an RC clip barely fitting underneath here is the piece of plastic it comes with doesn't really fit underneath that well um, let's see what else do I got here is an integy down wrench fits all the way until it gets to the metal part just some things to keep uh, keep in the idea guys when you're going to buy one of these or looking at these um, they're not going to be the best for carpet and things of that sort uh, but like cement floors will be fine on their floors are like a foam track I have coming which will be here soon it'll be great on that's why I bought this for uh, we bought a couple of them actually so when that foam track gets here I'll show you guys some more but uh, for now that's all I'm going to be able to do thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed the video leave a like and subscribe